Hi all, I am Dr. Asta. I am working as a specialist gynecologist with Astor Clinic in Arabian Ranches. Uh, today I am just going to talk a little about the normal common problem which as a female can occur to any age group uh, that is for the vaginal infection and the abnormal vaginal discharge. Normal vaginal discharge is odorless, colorless, okay, and so there is any change in the color of the discharge, or you feel any foul smell in the discharge, or there is any kind of itching or redness in your private areas. That is the time you should be definitely visiting your gynecologist and uh, to do a routine examination. So, we normally do some kind of the swab test and all to see what kind of bacterial infection is there. At, and a small antibiotic, of course, is going to help you for that. Okay. Why the screening for the discharge and why a visit to the doctor is important because if these discharges and the infections are not treated in the right time can lead to several problems in your vagina, in your cervix as well as in the vulva area. Along with this, I'm going to talk to you about the screening test, which is very, very important as a female. It's the pap smear. Uh, any history of recurrent infections, if you have, or otherwise also, you should be screening yourself with the pap smear if you are sexually active. And if you fall between the age group of 20 to 65. Normal screening test uh, for the pap smear is for the cervical cancer. It's a very, very simple method. To do that, you just need to visit your gynecologist and they'll just take Take a swab from inside and we'll send it for the testing and it is shown that if you have going to have any kind of problems in the cervix a single normal pap smear can detect it few years earlier so and very minor treatment can help you to treat the cervical problems so if you have any history of recurrent infections or otherwise also please visit, visit your gynecologist and get yourself screened with the cervical cancer and prevent yourself uh, for having any dreadful diseases later in your life. Thank you.